you want to make custom potions in Minecraft Bedrock, then this video is completely the right thing for you. So in this video I'll show you like three examples or something. I made this in a live stream, so don't worry, that's like 15 or something in that direction. I'm gonna show you the basic template and then you can do things yourself or just use the, uh, my examples at the beginning. First of all, we have tagged a has item equals item equals potion, data equals one, location equals slot that weapon dot main hand add potion. So this command block will give any player a potion who's so, uh, the tag potion who's holding a mundane potion. And not a water bottle, a mundane potion. You see? And then you need to uh, put it to needs redstone, repeat, and yeah, put a lever here and activate this lever if you want it to be activated because you can only have one potion active at a time with this or you can change the data value. Then we have this command block, I'm not gonna read all of this out loud, but basically we lose the tag potion and, uh, if we're holding any item that's not a mundane potion or a glass bottle. And then we have this tag at A has item equals, uh, I think you can read yourself, but if we have a glass bottle in our hands, we lose the tag. Uh, we first of all get the tech effect 6. You can call it whatever you want, like call it super potion if you want to, but as I said, I made this in a stream, it wasn't really creative with names. Then we need to create a scoreboard, which I'm going to show you how to do in a second. Scoreboard players at at A has item equals item equals glass underscore bottle. And yeah, again, you can read yourself. But however, uh, this is a chain conditional and always active and we get effect 6 and uh, we get 30 of it. So uh, the effect is active for 30 seconds. Then take at A, yeah, this has item part and then remove potion. So we trigger uh, the actual commands if we are holding, uh, if you were first holding a mundane potion and then a glass bottle. By the way, the tech is kind of unnecessary, but it's easier to understand like that, I guess. So, now, scoreboard players remove at A, scores equals effect 6 equals 1 or more, effect 6, 1. That's me, that means, uh, that is a delay in ticks of 20. That means that we lose 1 effect 6 the second, and we can, uh, yeah, we need to have a minimum of 1, uh, of 0 effect 6. Basically, that's what I wanted to say. Then, effect at A, score equals effect 6, equals 1 or more, strength 1.2. Another effect command. I'll just go through them like this. And basically, this is the first thing. You can add as many uh, effects as you want. Then we have uh, this little thing. Uh, make sure if you create a new potion to always it, uh, adjust the score mode related stuff like effect 6 in this time uh, in this type of potion and then if we have zero or less of this effect 6 score mode we get the tag also uh, removed as well and uh, I need to show you how to create the score mode slash score mode objectives at effect 6 dummy and then you can add like uh, effect 6 or something but you don't need to uh, enter a name that's displayed you just can't do this and yeah if you want to create any uh, other scoreboard then just change effect 6 with, uh, to effect xyz or something uh, yeah that's more related to your actual potion but however this was the first potion so now i'm gonna show you one more thing i said three examples but two are enough i guess uh that's different uh slash game mode zero then i drink this potion now we have gene pew plus grandfather and minecraft doesn't uh, like apostrophes it seems that's why one is missing. Don't comment that. Yeah, you see, this time it's uh, 
a little less amount of command box. Uh, and we have the same thing again. We get uh, the tech potion if we're holding a mundane potion. This command box is also equal. And then this time we don't do anything with text or scoreboards. We, ju do, uh, we just do execute at a. Uh, yeah, then this whole S item part. Run, summon zombie, and then the zombie's name, Jean Pueplu. Uh, I hope I pronounced the name correctly. Was one of my live stream viewers. So uh, don't wonder because of the name. Then another command block on chain conditional on always active. Take it A, has item, yeah. We just lose the potion again, the potion tech, I mean, uh, and yeah, again it's important that all of those um, need redstone and repeat and unconditional. And yeah, just make sure all of them are connected with uh, one lever. <coughs> and now we give GPU Blues Grandfather fire resistance without any tick delay. Because they didn't want me, uh, they want their grandpa to burn. That was the tutorial. If you have any questions, then yeah, just join my Discord server. It's linked in the description, and maybe subscribe to the channel if you want to.